Hello everybody and welcome back to Insane Brit Gaming. I'm the Insane Brit and this week's food review we have uh, 8 triple chocolate chunk cookie dough. Um, literally that's what it's called. Uh, these are basically uh, cookies. Uh, you do get 8. Now at the bottom is already open and I had a bit of an accident. Um, so here's the actual product itself so you just know what it looks like. I'll leave the link in the description below assuming I can find it. Um, I'm sure I will be able to but sometimes I can't uh, find certain products. Anyway so I had an incident because I was opening these and uh, I lost four of them because basically I dropped them on the floor. This ain't very sturdy and um, that's what they actually look like. So they are frozen. You do keep them in the freezer. Um, man, they're quite heavy individually. Man, it smells delicious. You can really smell that chocolate coming off there. they got white chocolate chunks in there as well. So they're quite consistent. They look quite nice. Uh, like I said, you do get eight. I dropped four of them. That's half my product all over the goddamn floor. Piss me off. I won't even lie. Um, but whatever. So, cooking instructions. They're only about 20 minutes to make, actually. Um, I'm trying to see where, how you cook them. I mean, what? I can't really find that right now. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Oh, here we are. 14 to 16 minutes in the oven, uh, blah, 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 160 on the on a oven fan, uh, gas for removal packaging, blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, pretty simple. All right, guys, I'm going to now cook these, and uh, I'll be back in a minute. Hey, guys, I'm back, and as you can see from the background, it is actually dark. Yes, it is dark, my God. Um, the cookies themselves, I've had to put on the lower gas uh, because of uh, it cuts out or whatever so but whatever that's just my problem it probably won't be your uh, issue um, however <laughs> literally these went on at 15 minutes to 4 it is now 5 o'clock they've had to go hard of course in the actual uh, oven I kept checking them etc they were soft and then eventually uh, uh, they got kind of hard anyway they smell absolutely delicious oh, fresh cookies out of the oven they're not burnt believe it or not that's just the way they're made, like the chocolatey. Um, so yeah, they're ready now. They smell absolutely delicious. Um, but my God, an hour to make these is like to cook them is ridiculous. Like I said, only 16 minutes. But then again, I had it on a lower setting because I have to. But that's probably just my issue. You'll probably be okay. These are boiling hot. Well, not boiling. They're just enough to hold uh, for me anyway. They're very crumbly right now anyway. So anyway, after about an hour of waiting, let's dig in. Hmm. Hmm. Very crunchy. Hmm. Oh, that chocolate really hits you, man. It's really nice. A little bit crumbly, but not too bad. Mmm. Feels a little bit chewy. Mmm. Man, very tasty, but I'm loving that. Mmm. I can't, I can taste a bit of the white chocolate, but it is simply overpowered by the chocolate, man. Oh, man. <clears throat> but no, which makes it nice and crunchy. Mmm. Absolutely delicious. I've only had one. My God. Mmm. That is that is goddamn tasty. 
nice and sweet as well. You wouldn't need to have sat and drink with these. My God, I've only had one. <clears throat> it makes you dry as hell, but there you go. <sighs> That's the price you pay. <clears throat> oh, man. Well, hmm. Nearly lost one. But they're nice and big. Look at that. I'm annoyed I've had to wait so long in the oven for them, but if most of you have to wait 16, 20 minutes, it's not too bad. Buy a, a pack or two and put them on the table, especially nice and hot. That is delicious. I know you can buy, pay and get 16, 20 for a pound or whatever in a packet, but they're not going to be freshly made like this or smell as delicious or taste as good. For frozen to cook, um, in 20 minutes, well, in my case, an hour, um, it tastes pretty goddamn good. It's worth it. Hmm. Hmm. Kind of messy a bit, but not not too bad. Hmm. I'll be honest with you, I've tasted a couple of cookie-based uh, products before, <clears throat> original cookie review, and um, other uh, the another cookie from Iceland, I believe it was, uh, one or two years ago. But I've got to say, out of all of them, those were cookies that were baked and left on the side. They weren't absolutely 100% fresh. They were like a few hours old. I know these were frozen, but these are just like cooked from frozen, but they're very, very nice, warm. And nice and hot, sorry. Um, they smell absolutely delicious, so it's best to get them when they're kind. I'd say fresh, but I'm going to say, like, just cooked. You know what I mean? Like, they're just, you know what I mean? Even though they're frozen, they're still just out the oven. Really nice and hot. Really tasty. Uh, not a lot of moisture in there, <clears throat> because um, it's just, you know what I mean? It's just dry. It's really dry. I won't even deny that. Uh, but like I said, with most things like cookies and stuff and chocolate, especially, you need to drink, so... Mmm. Mmm. The middle really holds the heat, man. It's really nice. Mmm. Absolutely delicious. Not bad <clears throat> for our Christmas, you know. Nice hot cookies, Christmas Eve, whatever you want to call it, around the holiday, that time. Definitely uh, get a bunch, a packet of these if you have friends over or whatever. Cook these, movie night, whatever you want to do. Absolutely delicious. Definitely recommend them. Not bad. And like I said, you'll probably have to wait 20 minutes tops and they'll be fine. Uh, just make sure they're solid. Um, I know they look burnt, but they're not. That's just the colour of the cookie in itself. But very, very tasty. A bit dry. Uh, for my liking overall. Um, so for me, well, I'm happy to give it a five. I'm going to down it to a four, just because of the dryness. Um, but then again, make what you want of it either way. It's uh, it's definitely recommended for me, especially fresh out the oven. Even though they're frozen, they're not bad. And they're cheap as hell. You buy a couple of packets of these, have a movie night with a couple of friends or whatever, or just on Christmas Eve as a treat. You make that choice. Anyway, guys, uh, so four out of five for Bimp for me, uh, possibly a five, but at the same time, you know, you'll have something to drink with it as well. Uh, anyway, guys, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. The link for this product will be in the link in the description below, and I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, Mafia Free continues next week. And then um, I'll go back to FIFA 19, where we will finish off the journey. Uh, anyway, guys, I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching.